you got a head or a tail. You got just got some kind of an emblem on one side or the other. It's a flip side. And that's the way it is between this in this world with God and the devil. And that's the way it's going to be at judgment time. It's going to be a judgment. That there's the wrath of God is going to come upon those who did not serve Him, did not seek Him, did not obey Him, did not follow after Him. And the other side is there's going to be a reward that will never end. The Bible says, no eye has seen, no ear has heard what God has planned for those that love Him. Many people go on these odd about experiences. God takes them, gives them glimpses to heaven. But no eye has truly seen, no ear has heard what God has truly prepared for us. Praise God. Hallelujah. I'd like to ask you to stand with me, please, in prayer. If you would, bow your heads and close your eyes. And let's just, just get before God in prayer to close out. Almighty Heavenly Father, yes, Lord. I just want to thank you, Lord, that you made this day yes. that we can rejoice and be glad in it, Lord. I just want to thank you, Lord, that you've given us another day to serve you in, Lord God. The Bible says to live is, is cry and to live is Christ. That means we're going to be serving you, Lord. We got to keep on working. But it says if we die, we're going to gain something. But Lord God, we know you got work to be done here, Lord God. And Lord, we ask that you give us long life and long years for all these men and these babies, Lord God. And these young ones, Lord God, so that they can grow up to know you and have a knowledge of you and to serve you and to do your will, Lord God. I thank you, Father, for the men and women and the families that are gathered in here today and the children, Lord God. I ask, Lord, that you bless them today, Father. Let them know, Lord God, that you are alive and well and still on the throne and that there's nothing impossible with you. And through Christ, who strengthened us, all things are possible. And I ask, Lord God, you just begin to pour out a blessing of the Holy Ghost. Let your spirit flow throughout this ministry, Lord God. And let these men become on fire for God. Let them not just be lukewarm. Let them not just be passe and everything every day. Let them come up and say, hey, I'm going to step up the plate. I'm going to step up there. I'm going to get down for God. I keep getting down for the devil. I'm ready to get down and I'm going to get up. And I'm going to hold my head high because I am a child of God. I'm his son or his daughter. I am a royal, a royal of blood mine. And I belong to that God. And that God belongs to me. And I'm an heir to him, Lord. And I thank you, Father, right now. That belongs to me out there. I'm going to claim it now. I'm not going to let the devil keep on stealing from me. He came to steal, kill, and destroy. But we're going to stop that plan today in the name of Jesus. We're going to begin to reverse the curse. And we're going to send it back from where it came as a sign and a witness that you are our Lord and you are the eternal God that will, dest that will destroy this world someday and the evil ones and create a new heaven and a new earth here. And we will reign with Jesus here. In the name of Jesus, I thank you, Lord, that you brought us together to be blessed by you. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Praise your Father. Hallelujah. And then with every head bow, yes, Lord, I love Give me my hand clap. Give me my hand clap. Let him know. 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 Hey, God, yes, I'm here today. I'm here today because of you and no other reason. I didn't come here for anything but because of you. I came here to see and to meet with you. And Lord God, I am so proud to know that you love me today. Hallelujah. Give him my hand clap. Give him my hand clap. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let him know. You know, God needs your attention. I mean, we spend our lives wandering to and fro, taking care of business, 
a lot of TCB going on. And I'm going to tell you right now, you've got to take care of your business, but you need to take care of God's business. You need to get them priorities in line. God first, family second, ministry third. You need to have your priorities in line because God is waiting for men and women to step up to the plate and get right and get real and hang in there. You may fall, but you got to get back up. I'm going to tell you something. It's not, you don't need to be ashamed of failure. But one thing you do need to be aware of you, you don't need to be a quitter. God will stick with you if you'll stick with Him. Hallelujah. Praise God. Now, with every head out, every head bowed and every eye closed, I just want to ask you right now. Nobody looking around. I just want to ask you right now. If you knew that Jesus Christ was going to demand that this body that you're living in should die today. Would you have total confidence, no doubt, that you would be with Him when you leave this world? If you have uh, any doubt at all that if you're up there knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door and say, God, let me in your house. And he looked up at you and said, I don't know you or what have you done to deserve for me to let you into my house? Or what would your reaction be? What do you think God would say? Is there any doubt in your mind? If you got a doubt, and nobody looking around and nobody, I just want to ask you right now, if you got that doubt in your heart, would you raise your hand? If you got a doubt in your mind, if you're not a hundred percent positive. I mean a hundred percent. If you've got a doubt in your mind, I just want you to raise your hand. If you've got a doubt, I see one, I see two, I see three, I see four. Brothers, I ain't going to embarrass you. But I want you to keep your hands up. I'm not going to ask you to come down here. But I want you to keep your hands up. I ain't going to embarrass you. And I want you to pray this simple prayer with me right now. Because I'm going to tell you, it's important that we dedicated these babies to God today. But the most important thing that God's interested in today, number one, is your salvation. Now I ask it again, nobody looking around, everybody, if you've got a doubt, raise your hand. If you've got a doubt, raise your hand. Keep your hand up for a minute. Your Bible says, if you're ashamed of me, I'll be ashamed of you. Amen. Keep them hands up. A couple of you put them back down. I ask you to hand. No, one of you put them, bring it back up there, brother. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Keep them up a minute. We're going to pray real quick right now. And I want you to pray with me, brothers. And others, you pray along with them. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Pray this with me. Lord Jesus, forgive me of my sins. I repent today. I want to change, God. Forgive me and receive me. I believe that Jesus Christ died for me 2,000 years ago so that I could have a life, eternal life, and life more abundantly in this world. And so today I receive 
And I repent. Forgive all my sins. And receive me, Lord. I believe that Jesus has saved me. So be my Lord now. And I'll be your son or daughter. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Give somebody a hand. Uh, give somebody a handshake and a hug before you get out of here today. find that picture because I keep it up and I looks at it and it just remind me of my of good old Christian days in, 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 in the church at the church yeah I, I just moves it around so much yeah I don't know where I don't put it I did have it in my Bible God bless us James John Paul and brother Al hold on hold on I enjoy his company a lot. He's fun. Because when these boys were little, I was just so busy working. Yeah, and yeah. Enjoying you missed it. Right. And now I'm really enjoying him. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And there's your Aunt Ethel May. Yes. There's your Aunt Ethel May, baby. God see, I know when I see you again. They don't forget. They don't forget his special voices. God knows she'd be your nanny if we was down mm -hmm. here. If, 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 I, if I could get her. Oh, well, I ain't having work. <laughs> Y'all be calling. Come get it. <laughs> For a few minutes. Well, Sonny's always camera shy. He don't want even look at me right here. <laughs> Now, hey, if you look look at me one more time. Well, let me hold the baby. Yeah. I hadn't held him yet. Yeah. Uh-oh. Don't be all right. He, he likes men. Yeah, I'll be all right. He likes men. He's on you, though. Uh-huh. Hey, brother. Yeah, once he gets with somebody for a while, he stays focused on me. Yeah. Yeah. He's just checking everything. I, I, I know it's a different. I don't know, it may, may be a difference in our arms or the way we hold them. Or it's something about a lady with babies, you know. Yeah. They know that. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, what's that over there? Huh? What's that? Hmm? Hmm? Oh, getting oh, excited. Getting teeth? Getting teeth? Yeah, teeth. Yeah. Yes. And he hasn't uh -oh. cut one tooth yet. What's that? He will. He will. He will. Yeah, they on the way. Yeah, you can tell because he's slobbered, you know. Nobody's going to see it but us. Okay. Yeah, work you soon. When you show, they say, who soon. is this all day? Focus. Focus? Okay. All right. We're supposed to say praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Lord, for bringing us all. He is worthy to be praised. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hey, Amen. hey. Yeah. We going? Yeah. Glory to God. His name. Yes. 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 Hallelujah. Alex, smile. Put your hand on your 